okay no more updates to this custom room the custom room i'm going to talk about in this video is a little bit different here for some of the users by the way a lot of users are already aware of this custom room and if you are not i'm going to talk about some of the things in this video and why this custom room is no more existed i mean why this custom room will not give you the new update we will talk about all of those things in this video so stay tuned firstly as you can see the default launcher is launcher 3 which is having some few of the customizations like other custom rooms and if i move on to the wallpapers and style options you will notice we have the custom themed icons which is one of my favorite features that if you want to try out custom themed icons if you have your own custom themed icons you can try one of them if you want to it's totally up to you including this one some options related to fonts customizations they are not major customizations this custom room is not focused on customizations but few useful things are included for example the system icon packs having the pavlova ui archers these are so amazing icon packs if I move on to the settings UI, you will notice the settings UI is exactly looking like stock Android, which is not having any kind of customization features. It still brings you some useful features and by default, we have all those available, but not available in the customization hub like CR Droid or like other custom rooms in CentOS, etc. In quick settings panel, you will notice we have the light quick settings panel and including this one, we also have the separate Wi-Fi and mobile data tiles available. By default, it's available with the internet tile, but you can simply enable Wi-Fi and mobile data separate tiles by clicking on edit icon available there including this one what we have is we have some options related to private dns and network traffic indicator this option is included and you can also notice the switches are a little bit different as compared to other stock android based custom rooms like pixel experience or maybe pixel extended and this is also one of the features if i move on to the battery section you will notice you have the option to customize the battery style too although it does not give you the options like ios 16 style battery indicator like in some of the custom rooms we have that feature available like spark os rising os etc as android 14 custom rooms are coming very very soon android 14 stable is already released and android 14 based custom rooms are coming very soon so if you're also excited for those then that is why this could be the last update of this custom room we'll talk about that later on by the way in sound and vibration section you will notice only some options related to smart pause which means some of the good options some features which are available in pixel devices are also present in this case if i move on to the display options and if i move on to the bottom or here you will see that data usage option is included this is one of the so useful features i know a lot of users use this thing and this is available i'm not sure if it is exactly working perfectly fine or not but it's included in wallpapers and style i've already shown you in security and privacy options you will notice face unlock fingerprint unlock everything is, is already present including this one if i move on to the other options for example more security settings you will notice the app locker is also present so it is of course a stock android but having some useful features this is better than stock android in app lock options you will also notice that you can hide the apps from the launcher without enabling the protection feature which is so good and uh, this is one of the features which shall be included in almost every custom room in system options you will notice some gestures available here and there same options like swipe to screenshot double tap to sleep playback control which is available here and else gesture navigation by the way this gesture navigation also has the ime space option available where you can hide the space below the keyboard for this i most of the times use module if that option is not available by default but in this case it's already included so these are the things available here time to show you what custom room i'm talking about in this video because a few are not aware of this yet or maybe if you already got to know let me tell you that this custom room is if you already guessed it or not let me tell you this one this is proton plus proton plus aosp i mean this was previously proton aosp but now it's proton plus and as you can see the proton plus version is 13.3 eol end of life and this is the last update why this is the last update let me tell you because they are just now renaming the whole project and now if you get the new update based on android 14 the room name will not be proton plus anymore the name will be something different uh, to be honest I, i'm not aware of that but this name of course will not be there unfortunately but that's it goodbye